Hello and welcome. This is Kendra and it's time to announce the prize winners for Kendra's card challenge number 12. If you're new to my channel and not familiar with my quarterly card making challenges, I offer a free printable with instructions on how you can use six sheets of six inch by six inch pattern paper to create a bunch of cards using the cutting templates and card sketches provided in the free PDF download. And by sharing the cards, you can have a chance to win lots of prizes from some awesome company prize sponsors. These prizes are valued at over $1,000. Challenge 12 started on October 1st and ended on December 31st of 2023. Now, if you're new to my channel and you didn't get to participate in challenge number 12 or any of the other previous challenges, you can still get access to the PDF printables over on my Patreon page when you join as a paid patron. I also have all of the archive challenges available for purchase individually over on my spring store. These links are listed on my website, kendrascardchallenges.com, at the bottom of the homepage. So let's jump right in with the showcase of all of the entries that were submitted in December in the Kendra's Card Challenges Facebook group. There were 403 entries this quarter. Since the challenges are open to card makers worldwide, we had entries from card makers from Austria, Australia, Belgium, Canada, Denmark, England, Germany, Israel, the Netherlands, Norway, the Philippines, Spain, Sweden, the UK, and the United States. Wow, it's so wonderful to see so many talented card makers from all over the world. In case you missed it, the new quarterly card challenge, Kendra's Card Challenge number 13, started on January 1st of 2024, and it runs through March 31st. This quarter's challenge is really special because we are collaborating with Call Me Crafty Al. The new challenge printable features four of Crafty Al's sketches from her past sheet load of cards. If you're not familiar with Sheetload of Cards, she offers a monthly printable where she gives instructions on how to make a bunch of cards using a card sketch, and it includes cutting guides for the pattern papers and the layers. I will link Alicia's YouTube introduction video in the description box below, so you can check out her January of 2024 Sheetload of Cards. And because we're collaborating this month, Alicia used one of my card sketches from Challenge 12, sketch number five, for her January Sheetload. So if you love this sketch and you'd like to make a bunch of cards using the same design, then you definitely want to check it out. If you want to learn more about my current quarterly card making challenge number 13, please visit kendrascardchallenges.com for information and to find out how to download the free printable. I will also link the Kendra's Card Challenge 13 introduction video above and in the description box. In this video, I give instructions on how to cut the six sheets of pattern paper, plus I explain how to enter the challenge for a chance to win prizes. Now, if you're watching this video during the premiere, please make sure you complete the form that's pinned at the top of the live chat box to have a chance to win the January of 2024 bonus printable, which is a Valentine themed digital card making kit that pairs with the challenge 13 sketches. It includes digital sentiments, images, and pattern papers. I'll be selecting the winner at the end of this video during the premiere, so make sure you make a comment in the live chat window and fill out that entry form. These bonus printables are available for download now by all paid patrons each month as part of the membership benefits. There were some new changes to the Patreon benefits that went into effect on January 1st, but to download the current challenge printable, you will need to join as a free patron member. Once you do, you will see the current challenge post and link to the PDF file that's pinned at the top of the Patreon page. If you'd like to receive extra perks and benefits, you can join as a paid member. Patrons help to keep the challenges free each quarter. Starting at just $5, you can receive access to a printer-friendly version of the challenge, access to a year's worth of archived previous challenges, and access to the bonus printables starting with the January of 2024 bonus. These bonus printables can include digital card making kits, digital sentiments, one sheet wonders, fun fold card tutorials, and more. And then the next tier for $10 a month, as an all access patron, you can receive everything I've already mentioned, plus early access to new card challenges, access to all previous card challenges, and a card making kit sampler, and access to all bonus printables current and past. And for $25 a month, VIP patrons receive additional benefits on top of what has already been mentioned. And these include a handmade card from me, a monthly card making kit, and a crafty live stream session each quarter. 
The card making kits include six sheets of pattern paper, coordinating cardstock, die cuts and or sentiments, plus embellishments, enough supplies to make 15 card fronts with the challenge. The card kit samplers include a few pattern paper and cardstock panels with die cuts or sentiments where you can make one to three cards, basically a smaller version of the full card making kit that VIP patrons receive. These kits will include products from some of the company prize sponsors and some other brands that you may or may not be familiar with. This will give you a chance to try out products from different companies. There are also monthly prize drawings and an exclusive Facebook group for all access and VIP patrons where you will find resources for the bonus printables, access to group chats and events. For more information about my Patreon, visit patreon.com forward slash Kendra's card challenges. I'll also have this linked in the description box. I would love it if you'd follow me on my socials if you're not already. You can find me at Cards by Kendra on Instagram, Pinterest and TikTok. And on Facebook, you can find my page at Cards by Kendra Morgan. It is a little bit different. But if you happen to share your creations on any of these social media channels, please feel free to tag me so that I can see your cards and follow you back. Your projects may even be featured. I have links to all of my socials in the description below. If you also use the hashtag for the current quarterly challenge, others can do a search on the different social media platforms and find your work. While I continue showing more of the photos, there's just a few reminders that I want to mention. In order to enter the quarterly challenges, you must upload one photo of all 15 cards into the official entry photo album for the month you're submitting it for. Additional entries in the same album will not be counted for prizes. Please include your name and country of residence in your photo caption. And after you upload the photo, please double check to make sure that it posted correctly because Facebook doesn't want to seem to save captions. This has happened several times to me, so please just go back and make sure it's there. If I don't know what country you're from, you won't be included in some of the prize drawings. Also, if you decide to also post a photo of your cards on the group wall so that others can see and comment on your cards, you can certainly do that, but please know that posting it on the wall does not count as an entry. It must be posted in the official entry photo album. And if you post on the wall, it would be super helpful if you could add a little note that it's been posted to the album as well. Also, please check the featured posts at the top of the Kendra's Card Challenges Facebook group, as this is where I post important information. Remember, you can also post photos in the individual sketch photo album so that we can see the cards up close. And each month I will use the photos in these sketch albums for the sketch winners. The first month of the quarter, I will reveal the sketch winners for sketches one through five. The second month of the quarter will be sketches six through 10. And the third month sketches will be the rest. Again, if you're watching this video during the premiere and you missed the beginning, make sure you complete the form posted in the live chat and also comment to have a chance to win a digital download. Now I'd like to ask you a few questions. If you're watching during the premiere, tell me in the live chat. If you're watching this after, let me know in the comments section below. You can number your answers. So question number one, what was your favorite sketch from challenge 12? And then question number two, if you have downloaded the new quarterly card making challenge number 13, what is your favorite sketch from challenge 13? I know some of you probably haven't started making cards yet, but just looking at them, which one is your favorite from challenge 13? And then my third question is, would you be interested in participating in a monthly color challenge? This would be an additional challenge each month where I would post a color palette and you can create any type of card you'd like using similar colors to what's in the color palette. It could be for any occasion, and it doesn't have to use, you don't have to use the sketches, but you would upload it to a designated photo album for a chance to win another prize. Again, let me know in the chat or in the comments, number one, two, three. And in case you missed it, I recently reached 5,000 subscribers here on YouTube, and I posted a video offering a giveaway prize. So if you missed that video, there's still time to enter. You'll just need to complete the entry form by January 6th to enter to win one of my favorite pink and main crafty courtyard kits called Let It Be. And I'm also giving away some of my bonus printables. As always, I post the winners on the community tab of my YouTube channel here. So make sure you're a subscriber and turn on those notifications so you'll know when I post so you don't miss it. In that 5K giveaway video, I also introduced the new creative team for Kendra's Card Challenges. There are 12 members on the video team and 15 members on the inspiration team. 
The video team will be sharing projects on YouTube using the Kendra's Card Challenge 13 sketches every week throughout the quarter, featuring pro products from our company prize super sponsors. The inspiration team will be sharing projects on Instagram and other social media. We have many hops scheduled for you to get lots of card making inspiration and have additional chances to win prizes. All of these hops are listed on my website, kindredscardchallenges.com, and they can be found under the Ways to Win Prizes page. I will have this linked in the description box as well. The team members always share some great ideas and tips about working with the challenge sketches. So I hope you'll check out their links and subscribe or follow them if you like what you see. There is a link to my creative team page in the description box where you will find more information about each of the members, plus the links for all of their socials. And just to give you a heads up on what's coming up soon, we have an Instagram hop beginning Friday, January 5th, where some of the members of the inspiration team will be showcasing sketches one through five of the new challenge 13. We also have a super sponsor video hop on Saturday, January 6th, where a few members of the video team will be sharing projects created with products from our super sponsor, Artful Angel, here on YouTube. Hop along with our inspiration team members over on Instagram between January 10th and January 15th to see birthday inspired projects using the new sketches. We also have additional hops in January featuring super sponsors, Polka Doodles, Colorado Craft Company, Cat Scrappiness, and Trinity Stamps. And in February and March, we'll feature Pink and Main, This Calls for Confetti, Whimsy Stamps, and a few others. So lots of exciting things are happening and more chances to win prizes. So I hope you'll join us. Now that we're wrapping up the showcase of the December entries, I will now reveal the winners for sketches 11 through 15, but I just have to say the card entries for challenge 12 have been absolutely amazing. If you do the math, we all created over 6,000 cards. That's so awesome. You all are so talented and I love seeing everyone's cards. All right, so here are the winners for sketches 11 through 15, who will all receive a handmade card from me and a die set plus the January of 2024 bonus printable digital download. The names for each sketch winner are shown on the screen. So congratulations to all of the sketch winners. Now let's see who the winners are for the December monthly prizes. All of the crafters who posted photos of all 15 cards into the December official entry photo album in the Kendra's Card Challenges Facebook group are listed in the spreadsheet and have been sorted by country. I'll start with the monthly prizes that have to be shipped. So I'll be selecting the entries from the United States first. I'm copying and pasting these entries for December into this box over here on wheelofnames.com. And I'm gonna shuffle these up. And we'll start with the two winners of a stamp set from Colorado Craft Company. And the first winner is Leanne, congratulations, Leanne. And the next winner, the second winner of the stamp set from Colorado Craft Company is Jenny Fu. Congratulations, Jenny. Now let's see who the winner is for the prize pack from Pink and Maine. And the winner is Carmen. Congratulations, Carmen. Next is the prize for a stamp and die set from Pixie Dust Designs. And the winner is Lori. Congratulations, Lori. And the winner for the confetti mix from This Calls for Confetti is... Lanny Westover. Congratulations, Lanny, or Lonnie. Sorry if I mispronounced that. <laughs> now let's see who the winner is for a die set donated by me. And the winner is... Jennifer Richie Cox. Congratulations, Jennifer. I 
All right, next is the winner of a stamp set donated by me. And the winner is... Linda Craig. Congratulations, Linda. And next is a mystery envelope full of crafty goodies. And the winner is... Tamara. Congratulations, Tamara. The next prize, I'm including a new mystery card making kit that is one of the new benefits of being a VIP patron. And the winner is... Karen Warns. Congratulations, Karen. Now, before I announce the remaining prizes, just one more reminder. If you're chatting with us in the live chat for the premiere, make sure you've completed the form pinned at the top of the live chat box for a chance to win a digital download. I'll be drawing the winner here in just a few minutes and I'll be posting it in the live chat. So stick around. Now the remainder of the prizes are items that are available to everyone. So I've gone back over to the spreadsheet and I've selected the remaining names for December that I didn't copy before and I've added them into this box. Now you'll see that I accidentally just uh, copied over the last name. So I have to delete these out and go back over to my spreadsheet to get the full name. But once I get these in here, we will be uh, finding out who the remaining winners are for the December monthly prizes for international viewers. So now let's see who the winner is for the $25 gift certificate to Crafty Meraki. And the winner is... Heather Miller. Congratulations, Heather. And now for the $25 gift voucher toward a digital download of your choice to Polka Doodles. And the winner is... <laughs> Kelly Otto. Congratulations, Kelly. Now let's see who the winner is for the $20 gift certificate to Pajama Crafter Stamps, where you can find products formerly from Prickly Pear Stamps. And the winner is Shanna McClure. Congratulations, Shanna. And now for the winner of the last monthly prize of a $20 gift certificate to Uniquely Creative. And the winner is Daria Sikorsky. Congratulations, Daria. Now let's pick the winners for the quarterly prizes for Challenge 12. So I'm going to go back over to my spreadsheet to select all of the entries for October, November, and December. And I'm going to copy all of these names over into the box that I just cleared out over on Wheel of Names. And while I do this, I just want to thank Rebecca with Paper Crafting with Rebecca. She's one of my design team members. I want to thank her for keeping track of all of the entries for me. She's done a wonderful job at reaching out to those who didn't post the uh, country in their photo caption. So if you could please help us both out by double checking when you post your photo to the album that your country is in there. That would really help us out a lot. But uh, as soon as these paste, <laughs> I think I've overloaded my system again. Here we go. Wow, that looks crazy. So let's uh, shuffle these up and let's first see who the winner is for the first Altenew gift certificate of $15. And the winner is... <laughs> Cecilia. Congratulations, Cecilia. And the winner of the second $15 gift certificate to Altenew is... Ella Moore. Congratulations, Ella.
And now for the $30 gift certificate to Artful Angel. And the winner is... Nicole Pig. Congratulations, Nicole. And now for the $30 gift certificate to Brutus Monroe. And the winner is... Terry McNeil. Congratulations, Terry. And for the $25 gift certificate to Catherine Pooler, the winner is... Karen Schaefer. Congratulations, Karen. And now for the winner of the $25 gift certificate to Gina K Designs. And the winner is... Sherry Yates. Congratulations, Sherry. And the winner of the $25 gift certificate to Cat Scrappiness is... Joan Smith. Congratulations, Joan. And now the winner of the $20 gift certificate to Craft and Kimmy Stamps. And the winner is... Cassia Banazak, I think is how you pronounce it. <laughs> Congratulations, Cassia or Cassia. And the winner of the $25 gift certificate to Lawn Fawn is... Holly Ruder. Congratulations, Holly. Now for the winner of the $25 gift certificate to Not Too Shabby Shop. And the winner is... Craig Smith. Congratulations, Craig. Now let's see who the winner is for the $25 gift certificate to Pear Blossom Press. And the winner is... Megan Close. Congratulations, Megan. Now let's see who the winner is for the $25 gift certificate to Pink and Main. And the winner is... Mary Ann Hires. Congratulations, Mary. Or Mari. And our next prize is a $50 gift certificate to Polka Doodles. And the winner is... Donna Murphy Valley. Congratulations, Donna. And the next prize is a $25 gift certificate to Scrappy Tails Crafts. And the winner is... Catherine O'Brien Smith. Congratulations, Catherine. The next prize is a $25 gift certificate to This Calls for Confetti. And the winner is... <laughs> Kelly Otto. Congratulations, Kelly. Man, Kelly, you need to play the lottery. <laughs> you won a December prize also. All right, and for our final prize, it's a Whimsy Stamps $50 gift voucher. And the winner is... Lynn Ashley. Congratulations, Lynn. Congratulations to all of the prize winners. 
Winners, please complete the form linked in the description box below to claim your prize by January 11th of 2024. Now I'd like to take a moment to thank all of the Kendra's Card Challenges patrons shown here. All of these wonderful supporters help to keep my challenge free each quarter. I also want to thank all of the wonderful company prize sponsors for Challenge 12 shown here. Their generosity and support is greatly appreciated and this makes this super fun for everybody. I hope you'll check out the links to their stores that I have listed in the description box to see what all they have to offer. Now these are affiliate links, which means if you make a purchase using any of these links, I earn a small commission at no extra cost to you. This is just another way you can help support my work. Before you leave, I hope you'll click the thumbs up button to like this video. Now, if you're in the live chat, please stick around. I'll be posting the winner in the live chat box soon if I haven't already. Congratulations again to all of the Challenge 12 winners. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to have you join me again soon. Have a wonderful day.